What's up guys, Simply Coco here and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another Let's Chat video where today we're going to be talking about the next expansion pack, expansion pack 11. So I said I wasn't going to record this video because there was no point. The trailer is coming out on Thursday, so I'm just going to end up doing another video on Thursday. But I just had to share my thoughts. <laughs> the more, like I said, I said I wasn't going to record this, but... I've been, you know, I'm usually on YouTube when I'm sitting here building and, you know, I've come across all of the Game Changers videos that got this postcard or whatever. Um, and I just had, like, I just had to record something and just give my thoughts. So, um, first of all, I guess if you don't know, I'm sure you do know, but <laughs> if not, the Sims team did tease Expansion Pack 11 today, this morning. They teased it. They, um... Or, okay, it wasn't officially the team. It wasn't officially The Sims 4 that teased it. It was Game Changers. So, a few weeks ago, some a few EA Game Changers got this postcard from The Sims team um, that was a teaser for the new expansion pack. And I guess they kind of... I guess The Sims team told them that they could post stuff about it today. So, all of these Game Changers have been posting stuff about it today. So I'm going to read to you what the postcard says, show you the postcard, and then just give my thoughts because I have a few um, and I just want to share them. So let's hop over to the Sims Community uh, blog site and let's, let's, let's talk. Let's chat. <laughs> okay, guys, here we are over on the simscommunity.info. So this is the what it looks like, um, what the postcard looks like. It's greetings from Hinford on Bagley. And then this is what the back of it looks like. And if it was, if it's going to load, hello. That's what the back of it looks like. And we'll read that in just a second. Um, but I'm going to kind of read through this post really quickly. So it says, we've received a mysterious new postcard from the Sims team, both via mail and in our inbox about this brand new town called Henford on Badley. Bagley. So apparently that's the town's name. Uh, I've, I've heard a lot of people say that sounds very English inspired, like British inspired, England inspired, however you want to say that. Um, but I guess we'll get into that more when I talk about the pack. I mean, talk about my thoughts. Uh, as you can see in the front of the postcard, there's new countryside world. There's a new countryside world coming to The Sims 4. And we got intel from Mrs. Crumplebottom that it might be related to the brand new expansion pack for The Sims 4 coming this summer. However, there's more. There's a whole back of the postcard as well with a personal message from none other than Crumple Bottoms, blah, 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 blah. So let's read what it says. It says, Dearest friend, if you don't, I said this already, but this was sent to EA Game Changers. So no one got this except for a select few of EA Game Changers. Uh, it says, Dear, Dearest friend, we are so pleased you're joining us in heart for we're <laughs> we are so pleased you're joining us in Henford on Bagley. I'm sure you will I'm I cannot speak today. I'm sure you will enjoy the quaint countryside life. Do come visit us at our garden style when you arrive. Oh my gosh. What is happening? I cannot read or speak today. <laughs> Do come visit us at our garden stall when you arrive. A and A Crumple Bottom. So one of those is Agnes. I just watched uh, Plum Bella's video and I don't know. And she was trying to figure out who the other, who the husband is, if it's a husband. But I don't think she found it. I don't know. I don't know who the other A is. It says, P.S. I heard the mayor talking about a worldwide tourism video for Henford on Bagley premiering June 10 at 8 a.m. Uh, PT, uh, specific time, I believe, on www.youtube.com slash sims. How exciting. So, excuse me, trailer coming out on Thursday, and we just got a game pack, what, last week or two weeks ago? That is so crazy how quickly this summer thing is, this summer of Sims is happening. Um, and if you remember back, let me try to search it. Summer of Sims. If you remember back, is it going to search? Here we go. If you remember back to this post, so 
they they tease the expansion pack here as well where it says bond with nature in this charming new expansion pack i made a video talking about this saying i thought it was going to be some sort of fairies pack or that it could be a fairies pack um something with some other occult sims and there were some reasonings behind why i said that go check out that video uh, i don't remember exactly what i said but there's also been a few hints in the dream decorator pack that it might be a farming pack and all of this um yeah i have okay i have some thoughts but i'm gonna that's all i have to show you so i'm gonna hop back over to full screen and give you my 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 thoughts and then we're gonna try to quickly wrap up this video okay so just a few thoughts so I, at this point, I think it's going to be a farming pack. One, because of the, the hint we got in Dream Home Decorator, that tent, that kid's tent that came with the pack that really doesn't fit with anything in the pack. It's just kind of there in the very first swatch. has pigs and cows and chickens and all of that on it. Um, and then it's a countryside world. It's a countryside world. And that teaser said bond with nature. So at this point, I'm fairly certain it's going to be a farming pack. If it's not a farming pack, I will be very, very upset. Um, I, and those of you that watch my let, that watch my Let's Chat videos, I'm always the one to say, I don't care what the pack is. I'm just happy we're getting new content, and that is going to remain true. For me, I'm going to be happy that it's new content regardless. I'm going to buy it regardless. But I will be very, 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 not mad, not angry, but disappointed if it's not a farming pack. Because I feel like at this point, if it's not a farming pack, it's going to be a humongous slap in the face to all of us. I know farming isn't going to be every Simmer's cup of tea, but I feel like the vast majority of Simmer's have been specifically asking for it and then when we got that fake leak that it that the last expansion pack was going to be a farming pack a lot of people were excited about it no one was really like i don't want this and i've i was watching miss griffey's video on this and she said that one of the sim gurus actually said that this pack is going to include is going to make a lot of people happy so she was saying how she thinks it's going to be farming and she thinks it's going to include some other things that are going to make people happy too whether that be family gameplay improved babies cars something i don't know because maybe we'll have tractors and since they're giving us tractors maybe they'll have an animation for cars i don't know but at this point i feel like it's going to be a slap in the face to us simmers that that want a farming pack if it's not a farming pack because they're hyping it up so much and giving all these hints that point towards farming pack. And it, yeah, I'm going to keep saying it. But if it's not a farming pack, I'm going to be very, very, very disappointed. It would be a huge slap in the face. And it's a countryside world. I consider Brindleton Bay a countryside world. Because it's if you look at Brindleton Bay, there's even some lots that look like a barn should be on it. I, there's one lot that I've built on. It's the it's the lot that that by default is the dog park. Behind there, there's like a bridge. Some whoa. <laughs> Behind that lot, there's like a bridge. Um, it's just set dressing, but it's like a bridge, and the 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 thing that covers the bridge looks like a a red barn. So like Brindleton Bay, which came with cats and dogs, that should have been our farming world. Cats and dogs should have been a full fleshed farming pack. Um, I mean, we can say that it didn't happen, so we, I mean, we can't change it, but I just feel like at this point, if it's not a farming pack, it's going to, it's going to be almost pointless because not pointless, but we already have a countryside world. So why are you giving us another countryside world if it's not going to be farming? So if it's just going to be a British inspired court courtyard if it's if it's just going to be a british inspired countryside world with fairies i don't want it <laughs> i don't want it i mean yeah i'll i'll buy it for the build and buy and all of this but 
You could have gave us something else with the fairies. I don't. I mean, a, you could have gave us a fantasy world if it's going to be fairies. I don't know. That's really all the thoughts I had, though. It's just I will be very disappointed if it's not a farming pack at this point. Um, and if it's not a farming pack and they gave us another countryside world, it's just kind of like, what the heck, Sims team? <laughs> I mean, it would be great that this this pack would be, or this world would be more... British, England, English inspired and not American. We love that, but we already have Bernalton Bay. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, that's my thoughts though. Hopefully it's a farming pack. Um, it better, it, I can't say it better be. I just hope it is. If not, I'll be very disappointed. Will I still buy it? Yes. Um, but I guess we'll see on Thursday. And Obviously, I'll do. I'll either do a trailer reaction, or if I miss the trailer due to work or whatever, I'll just talk about it in another Let's Chat video. But yeah, we'll see what happens on Thursday. This video did not have to be 11 minutes long, but here we are. Let me know what you think down in the comments. Um, do you think it's going to be a farming pack? How are you going to feel if it's not a farming pack? If it is a farming pack, what do you want to be included? Uh, I want all the animals. All the animals. <laughs> At least the ones that were on that tent. So pig, chicken, cows, horses. I don't want it to be a farming pack where we can only like sell the plants that are already in-game right now or something. Or I don't know. It better be fully fleshed out. Uh, let me Anyway, let me know all your th thoughts and stuff down in the comments. Sorry if you heard that clap in the mic. Um, but that's all. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll always respond to your comments and please hit that notification bell that way you know exactly when I post my next video, exactly when I post it and I will see you all then. Bye guys.